Hello my soccer universe for another unpacking video and you saw the title I have finally bought a USA away jersey thinking you know I'm already preparing a little bit for for the World Cup and I'm closing in on the goal of having a jersey for every team at the moment there's only uh, three missing where two I have already made arrangements and it's only the hosts where I'm having some trouble but you know by the time this posts this might not have been so i'm also looking at my collection in general you know have a home under the way option that kind of mirrors a little bit what is happening at the world cup so uh that was my thinking as of late and so uh one team where i really thought an away jersey will probably be very handy yeah of course the united states i have two white jerseys this one and the one from the 2010 world cup which was my first one um but you know in a way jersey i have lived in the us for 10 to 10, 10 years i really think i should have more than only two uh, home jerseys although this is probably my favorite us jersey of all time so yeah da, 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 da. here is an away jersey in there it is a used jersey it is in l question is what color is it and what year is it now i can tell you from here uh the condition is over quite good except for a few patches that don't look that great but you will see that in a little bit so here comes the reveal da, 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 da. yeah getting all american here of course it's the 2010 away jersey uh that's the one that i've been looking for for a long time and the funny story is when i was um funny story i don't know when i was getting uh to buy this one here um i was really torn shall i get the home or shall i get the away because the home is very simple but very much us but the away uh is i really like the sash in there and it's a little bit more in your face in a way and you, it has the beautiful navy color um and so i was yeah uh going back and forth and then i was asking my friends and colleagues at work which one should, should i get should it be the blue one and the white one and i think i asked 10 people and the votes were split five five and then in the end i, I decided okay let's go with the more traditional looking one and i was in the end not too unhappy with the choice because in, uh, they beat algeria wearing this one however they got the draw against england in that one and the uh, draw against slovenia where they, they, they were cheated also so yeah um then this came out and it was right at the time when it was about to leave the us and i thought it's a nice uh, mem memory that i absolutely love i mean this should be the us crest for all time but that's a different story and so i have two white ones and i said yeah maybe i should have gotten the blue one and it, i rarely have seen it and now it popped up uh it cost me 20 euros plus shipping so uh, oh no 20 uh, 22 euros plus shipping so i'm very happy to have that one over it's in a really really good condition the only thing that is not good is you see here the inside tag is more or less vanished and you see the same thing happening here on the usa tag but other than that it's the same size as the home jersey other than that, it is in a really, really proper and good condition. I'm looking forward to wearing this uh, or having it during, during the World Cup. Go USA. In a way, I, you know, I have my favorites, but for me, the US, I mean, well, um, one of those nations that I support because, you know, I have ties to that country. So, yeah, uh, I would assume that the US are wearing uh, again a dark blue jersey against England. So very much looking forward to wearing this jersey the day after. But, you know, made a better team win. Uh, my only gripe with this jersey and with US jerseys for a long, 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 long time. This crest is ridiculously bad ridiculously bad it's a 90s creation but not only does it feature the soccer ball here what's even worse is uh stars and stripes the stripes should be in red why is this blue if they switch around the blue and the red on this crest 
I think you have, you may have something, get rid of the ball, but this is just ridiculously bad. Now the modern one is a little bit better. It's not this one though. So uh, that's the only grab that, 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 that I have. Now, um, I also know that probably this will not be my last uh, US jersey. I have to say around this time between 2010 and 2013, they released quite some nice ones. There is a uh, red version with a blue sash which is all right, which um, interestingly enough, they played on my wedding day. We, I got married in California. Uh, they played in uh, Los Angeles against Mexico in the Gold Cup final where yeah, my brother kind of scolded me a little bit. We could have, pl you could have planned your wedding a bit better. Well, didn't think about it. There were more important things happening that day. So that, 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 that was one thing where they played then in the red with the blue sash, which I think is nice. Um, I really, really like the home jersey from the next tournament, which is kind of the Waldo look, uh, where you have the white jersey with the red uh, stripes, across, the red um, bands across, kind of mirroring the flag, which I would agree this would be the perfect look for a US jer uh, jersey, add to that blue pants, and you have a perfect look for a US home jersey. And yeah, I think actually my favorite one would be the one from 2009 home where they made it all the way to the Confed Cup final. That one I really, really, really liked. And, and I think even the 2006 one. But I think at around that, that period, there were really, really nice ones, all with the same flaw. This one here. This one here. Um, I also thought that the one that was released for 2018 uh, didn't look half bad. But... Uh, it is the Waldo look, kind of, but there's also Russian flags in there, which I don't think that looks all that nice. In any case, that's me and my US uh, jersey collection. Very happy to have another 2010 jersey up there. So, I mean, you have two here. You have this one, then I have a few European for Nike ones. So, I... I realized that the 2010 World War World Cup was a very special one for me. It was not the greatest World Cup, but it was a very special one for me. So, you know, getting jerseys from the World Cup, very uh, happy. And, you know, now I have all the jerseys that US wore during the tour tournament. And as I said, I, I really love this jersey um, and I'm very happy to have them both. In any case, let me know what you think about this one. Uh, give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more and I will talk to you soon. Bye. Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you actually might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel and click the little bell icon so that you get notified whenever something happens in my soccer universe. And with that, have a wonderful day!